Gabriel Klein had the clear intention to uh, murder both girls and succeeded with murdering uh, Letitia Reimer. It was a brutal attack that left one student dead and another badly injured. On Friday, 26-year-old Gabriel Klein was found guilty of second-degree murder after stabbing to death Abbotsford student Letitia Reimer. Outside the court, a family spokesperson read out a statement from the victim's family. I'm thankful that this phase is now wrapped up and we'll wait to see what the sentencing will be. However, the people who are really serving the sentence are those of us who no longer have Letitia in our lives. On November the 1st, 2016, Gabriel Klein walked into Abbotsford Senior Secondary School with a stolen hunting knife and stabbed to death Letitia Reimer 14 times. He then went on to attack another student who suffered serious injuries but survived. Klein's lawyers argued for a lesser manslaughter charge, saying his client suffered from schizophrenia and was not aware of his actions. He expressed shock and regret at what he, was, what he did. I think he was... Uh, he, at least he expressed he was as surprised as anyone by what he had done. However, the judge in the case ruled that there was no evidence that mental issues affected Klein's ability to see consequences to his actions, saying his conduct was incomprehensible. I certainly believe that there's a mental health component here. I, th I think we certainly see that our, our governments need to play a role in that, but just as much as they need to play a role in supporting victims of crime. Second-degree murder carries a mandatory life term with no eligibility for parole for at least 10 years. Sentencing is expected in early June. In Vancouver, Tom Walsh, City News.